It was a busy 4th of July for emergency responders across the valley. In Fargo, the Fargo Fire Department responded uh, to 12 fires that were fireworks related. And they also responded to a fireworks-related medical call. A person lost their thumb and a finger when a uh, firework exploded in their hand. And at 5.27 p.m., a report of a diving accident on Maple Lake near Mentor, Minnesota. All identifying information has been deleted from this emergency call. Uh, diving into the lake, hit his head on the bottom, uh... They have him laying on the ground there, um, having tingling in his hands, um, not feeling well. And at 7 p.m. up in far northeastern North Dakota at Pembina, an ambulance called for a child who suffered a dog bite. For an animal bite of a juvenile. Later, radio traffic indicated it was a dog bite and it was serious enough that the uh, child was being transferred to Grand Forks. Then at 7.42 p.m. on the 4th, a report of a car upside down in the water in Griggs County. Here's that emergency call. Cooperstown ambulance, Cooperstown ambulance, response to an unknown injury accident. Response to an unknown injury accident on Highway 1. Near my marker 101, it's going to be a vehicle that is upside down and in the water. Unknown occupants. Acknowledge that he's a radio at 7.42. Again, that was an emergency call out of uh, Cooperstown, North Dakota, Sunday evening. I talked with the Griggs County Sheriff's Department, and I'm told the uh, that crash is being handled by the North Dakota Highway Patrol. If there were injuries, we should have an update on that uh, here later today. And finally, uh, getting messages of another serious crash in Clearwater County, north of Bagley, up in the Gonvick area. Uh, no details yet. Uh, we've got calls in, and we hope to have an update on that uh, later today. But a report of a serious car, uh, car accident in the Gonvick area in Clearwater County, Minnesota, on Sunday evening. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for iNews.tv.